the by Ekenemon or the police. Um, okay, uh, this is just a quick one. Uh, uh last time, um, Melo video concerning Nekene, Nekenelo, Solu, the work, um, uh, Onosi, where my universal basic education called the free Nanambra, how encouraging all the um, after that, some people took it uh, personal, some people felt bad, uh, for some reason. So, though most of the reach out to me, but one on the well, private schools, yes. So, but then I need to make this very clear one, the idea of uh, encouraging the model, Kahapo go when her government school or public school, Abulo to discredit the private schools, or maybe uh, it projects that now, private schools, the useless in our society, no. The idea is this, one, our focus is on community development. And if you really want the community to develop, basic education is a must. Yes, it's a must. Normal people will always, there will always be class in the society. Uh, where people and where people in Akolomoha as much as five million uh, in school. When they have five hundred thousand, when they have five hundred thousand, you know there are schools, private schools. They um, they for the rich, for the bourgeoisie. No, but if there is maybe a private school at this day called the, the normal standard in our society, will it frustrate? Most of the poor people that cannot afford it, and most of them, there's a more MSC ignore it, they good care of those government schools or make it affordable. Now, most of Omar Kandama Kosizelega, that government school, for, um, for the dropout. Now, MSC have a bull problem to the society. So, the idea, and again, some. Uh, because all of that now, any focus on the government school, those are government schools, so no question like that. And all of that, do go do available and affordable and up to a universal standard. Then, and all of that now, only show people can wear private school is allowed. And all game people, private schools will step up because the competition will be high. Obu mo oye de ka maybe ebo nye kuchata lo flat mo be ye na obu ya school. Squeezing uh, uh, Omar Kanime, those places, doing all sorts of things in order to make profit. No. But once the government made the basic ones of Akwa Seleme, provide that the necessary, the proper environment, which Soludo is trying his best, then private schools, people are uh, free to come into the business. But once the government own the high up a certain standard, then the, the stake in the private school also will rise. The, the game we afford will go there. So the idea is not to run private schools down or to make private schools seem like no well if I find them. No, they are they are trying. As a matter of fact, in some places, it's because of private school that some people in that area got a dual afford education, both in terms of di distance. Uh, maybe the availability of government school, the distance and everything. These private schools bridge the gap. But that is not the reason why government engages. They have to say their own responsibility. The education of every child is the right, is the right of that child. That universal basic education from nursery school to GSS3 is basic and is the right of that child. And by providing it properly, affordably, and with proper environment and all the facilities, will it help community development? But if it's not properly done, if we say that now, the uh, 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 most the government school will just be abandoned, just like it is in many communities, in many states. But now our governor coming into it, picking interest in it, he should be encouraged. It has in, and he's making effort, he should be encouraged. And our people too, from all sides, can as well contribute to this. It's part of community development. And education is the key. Because and starting it early is the most important. 
starting it early or boom boom what are killing what they're silly they destroy they destroy the cycle they go destroyed a busy maybe silly a fire brigade here now like now uh uh exam or practice is almost becoming the trend now in nigeria that now basically i never prepare for erica why i got up prepare or have for uh for runs most of the principals are involved teachers are involved this is basically a way of destroying those children it's basically a way of destroying our society because you are legalizing uh, exam malpractice in, in other words you are also destroying the value system of that child because we be alone Teacher Kosele, he worked at the time. Kuzel wanted to create for Kosele. Kuzel, Buluze, he was our champion. Now help, he manage, he organize exam and practice. You've automatically killed the values, the value system of that child. So these are things we're trying to. We're talking about community development. We're talking about getting the society to be the way it should be. This education is the key. The basics. The basics that early education is very very important. And obu neme yo fuma onyelo makaya kafa form of a develop properly. Then well the fund can take your your kids abroad. You can send them to any school, but those basic basic ones should be properly taken care of. And since the gov the the uh, the government is helping, Governor Soludo is is uh, taking interest in it. He should be highly encouraged and other people other stakeholders can as well help the government because it is key to community development to human resource development and if you don't develop the human capacity the human value system whatever you do you also quite give me in that society because Obu Nana, those children, they mismanaged at the early stage. They were not properly uh, groomed. They were not properly trained. They were not given proper orientation. Whatever you do in that society, whatever you build in that society in the name of government, they will destroy it because their value index is wrong. And before you know it, they, their mind will be twisted. They will focus on all sorts of rubbish because they were not properly groomed so it's very important and government is the right channel it's not a threat to private schools but it has to be properly done government has to be involved just like today now we know that if government starts uh, putting up um uh, if our water corporation comes alive now and start putting up uh, water uh, water systems and uh, all that those people doing pure water business will become uncomfortable but then these are normal things these are proper things to do but then if governments have a proper water system those in pure water business will beef up their business they will do it more properly so that theirs will be better than what the government is providing and give people alternative and the competition becomes you know bigger the state becomes high so it's very very important so Munem, we are not trying to run anybody's business down but we are trying to get our society on the right track by encouraging the government and encouraging people encouraging people to help the uh the government to do what they should do and other individuals let them pay attention to that because it is the only way the starting point of we having a strong community uh, uh, development system the most important thing in the in, in the process of developing a community developing a society is the education and that education has to be given when those people are still very young so that they will get the right orientation towards life towards value system so that not later in years now we'll go into uh you know crisis management you go into reforms you go into 
like these days now, a lot of people were having a lot of crisis, insecurity. People are desperate to make money by all means. Nobody wants to work because the value the, the value system has been twisted and most people now believe that once uh once you have money and whichever way you get that money is okay no people have to be encouraged to do things legally just like today now a lot of people buy their results their work and everything and we now see the the you know the damage during our hospitals our institutions because the system have long been bastardized a lot of people didn't make their results now how do you reform the value system if you don't start early to teach these children what it means to learn properly and do your exam by yourself and um, you know have the proper value channel so that is what we say. We're not trying to run anybody's uh, business, but the government should do the needful. The individuals in the society should do the needful. Then the stake will be high. The standard will come up and it will help our society. Thank you very much for understanding. We still like your comments. We still like your reactions. You know, you're free to put up your reactions. You're free to, you know, reach us so that the the idea is just to enlighten people to create awareness especially where it concerns development human development and you know other uh development in the society to make our life better to make the life of the incoming generations better thank you very much and remember to subscribe to benjin tv and follow us on all our social media platforms May God always bless you. Thank you.